As a sole trader or small business owner, it's important to stay on top of your invoicing. Now that doesn't just mean remembering to send them out, you also need to know which invoices are due and who you should be chasing for payment. Hello, hello, Sharon here, and in this video, I'm going to show you three easy ways of highlighting overdue invoice dates in Google Sheets, so you can see at a glance who still owes you money. So let's crack on. So you can see in my example here, this is a basic invoice list. So I have the invoice date, the number, the due date, the client, and the amount owed. And we want to highlight any invoices that are overdue. So in this first example, I'm gonna be showing you how to apply a color scale where any invoices that are overdue will be colored in red and any that are in the future are colored green. To do this, we're going to be applying conditional formatting. What we need to do is highlight the cells where you want the conditional formatting to apply. So in this case, it will be the due date. And then you can either go to format in the menu and go to conditional formatting. Or another way would be to right click your mouse and go, if conditional formatting isn't there, click on view more cell actions at the bottom and go to conditional formatting that way. This will open up the conditional formatting rules window and over on the right hand side. And you can see that everything is automatically defaulted to green because at the moment the format rules says that if the cells are not empty, then to color them green. So we're going to change this now. The apply to range is the range of cells where you want the conditional formatting to apply. So this at the moment says C4 to C10, which are the cells that we highlighted at the start. And as I mentioned in this first example, I want to use a color scale. So instead of single color at the top here, click color scale. And where the default view is here, you click on there and you can change the colors of the color scale. So I want it to go from red to green. Click on there. So you can see straight away that the invoice that is most overdue is in a dark red and it's gradually getting lighter as the dates move on and then the one furthest away that is, is way in the future is a green. If you don't like the colors that are set, then you can set them here on the minimum value. You can choose a different color. So if we can have like a bright red and a midpoint, we can have like a, a pale yellow and the maximum point, we can have a, a bright green. And when you're happy with it, just click done. If at any time you want to remove the conditional formatting, click on any cell where the conditional formatting is applied. And if you go to the condition formatting rules, hover over the conditional formatting here and you can see there's a bin over on the right hand side to remove the rule. Just click on there and it's removed. And you can either click on the cross to get rid of the conditional formatting altogether, or you can click add another rule. So onto the next rule then, and I'm gonna show you now how to highlight any invoices that are due before a specific date. So if I highlight these, this column first, where the due dates are, and we click on add another rule. This time I want it to be a single color. You can see the range of cells has already been applied. And this time we want to format cells. So where it says is not empty, click on the drop down here. And we want to say that the date is before a specific date. So in this example, I want to know if any invoices are due before Christmas. So I'm gonna say date is before, and then underneath here it says today, and it gives you some preset options here, which are quite good, but we want to say an exact date. So I'm gonna put in Christmas day. And I want it to be colored in red, but I want the text to be white, just so it stands out a bit more. And I want it bold. And then click done. So you can see here, these are the invoices that are actually due before Christmas day. Another handy one is to highlight any that are actually due before today. No matter when you go into the sheet, today is today. All you need to do is highlight these cells, click on add another rule over on the right hand side and format cells if, click on the drop down arrow and the date is before and we want to say the date is before today. And again, click on the color that you want and click done. So basically, no matter when you open this spreadsheet, any you know that any that are highlighted in red are overdue, no matter when you, when you click in the spreadsheet. So you can see at a glance who you need to chase for money straight away. And there you have three handy ways of highlighting overdue invoices. I hope you found that helpful. Let me know in the comments below if you use any conditional formatting rules like this in your invoicing spreadsheet. As I mentioned earlier, watch this video next to create a real simple invoice 
using a template that is pre-built in, into Google Sheets already. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.